The Incas were an indigenous civilization in South America that flourished in the Andean region during the 15th and 16th centuries. They were known for creating one of the most powerful and sophisticated empires in pre-Columbian America. The heart of their empire was centered in the Andes Mountains of modern-day Peru. The Incas were remarkable for their advanced engineering, especially in agriculture and construction. They built extensive road networks connecting different parts of their empire and constructed impressive stone structures without the use of mortar, like the renowned city of Machu Picchu. Their society was highly organized, with a centralized government headed by an emperor known as the Sapa Inca. They had a complex social structure, an extensive system of taxation, and a unique form of record-keeping using knotted strings called quipus. Religion played a significant role in Inca society, and they worshipped a variety of gods, with the sun god Inti being one of the most important deities. The disappearance of the Inca Empire is a historical enigma, marked by a combination of factors that led to their downfall. The disappearance of the Incas began with the arrival of strangers from Spain. These newcomers, led by people like Francisco Pizarro, reached the land where the Incas lived. The Spanish explorers were after the Inca treasures, especially gold and silver. They wanted control over the Inca territories and their riches. When they arrived, they brought along their own way of life, which was very different from the Incas. The Incas were surprised by these strangers and tried to understand them, but the Spanish were looking to conquer and take over the Inca lands. This created a lot of tension and conflict between the two groups. The Spanish had powerful weapons and technology that the Incas had never seen before. This made it very hard for the Incas to protect themselves and their way of life. Even though the Incas were brave and fought to defend their homes, they couldn't match the strength of the Spanish forces. The arrival of the Spanish marked the beginning of a difficult time for the Incas. It led to battles, conflicts, and changes that eventually played a big part in the disappearance of the Inca civilization. When the Spanish arrived in the land of the Incas, they carried sicknesses like smallpox and measles. These were diseases that the Incas had never encountered before, and they had no immunity or natural defense against them. The Incas, being unfamiliar with these illnesses, got very sick. Many of them fell ill and couldn't fight back. These diseases spread quickly among the Inca population, causing widespread sickness and death. The new diseases weakened the Inca people and their society. It made it harder for them to resist the Spanish conquest. Because they were so sick, the Incas couldn't defend themselves effectively, and this made it easier for the Spanish to take control. The impact of these new diseases was devastating for the Incas. It weakened their population, made them vulnerable, and played a big role in the decline and disappearance of their civilization. The Spanish were powerful and had better weapons and armor compared to the Incas. When they arrived in Inca territory, they wanted control and riches. The Incas, though brave and skilled, couldn't match the Spanish military strength. There were battles between the Incas and the Spanish, but the Spanish forces were too strong. Despite the Incas fighting hard to protect their homes and land, they couldn't win against the Spanish. The Spanish conquistadors took control of the Inca Empire. They captured the Inca leader, Atahualpa, which caused a lot of chaos and weakened the Incas even more. Although the Incas tried to resist, the Spanish were too powerful, and their conquest led to the downfall of the Inca civilization. The Spanish conquest was a significant reason for the disappearance of the Incas. It changed their way of life, destroyed their cities, and led to the loss of their independence and culture. If you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for more history topics. When the Spanish arrived, they sought control over the Inca lands and treasures. Atahualpa, the Inca leader, met with the Spanish, hoping for peace. However, the situation turned grim when the Spanish captured him. Atahualpa was taken captive by the Spanish, despite promises made to him. The capture of their leader caused a lot of confusion and sadness among the Incas. It weakened their morale and left them without a strong leader to guide them. The Spanish used Atahualpa's capture as leverage, demanding a room filled with gold and silver as ransom. Even after the ransom was paid, the Spanish didn't keep their promise and executed Atahualpa. This caused further turmoil among the Incas and led to a power struggle among different Inca leaders. The capture and subsequent execution of Atahualpa made things very difficult for the Incas. It created chaos and weakened their resistance against the Spanish conquest. This event played a significant role in the downfall of the Inca civilization. Before the arrival of the Spanish, 
the Inca Empire faced internal struggles for power. After the death of the Inca Emperor Huayna Capac, his sons, Atahualpa and Huascar, fought for control over the empire. This led to a civil war among the Incas. The conflict between Atahualpa and Huascar divided the Inca people. It weakened their unity and made them vulnerable to external threats, like the Spanish invasion. The internal fighting among Inca leaders weakened the empire's ability to resist the Spanish conquest. While the Incas were busy fighting among themselves, they became less prepared to defend against the powerful Spanish forces. The internal conflicts within the Inca Empire played a significant role in their downfall. It created disunity among the Inca people, making it easier for the Spanish conquistadors to conquer and take control of their empire. The Spanish didn't just fight the Inca people, they also destroyed many Inca cities and roads. They damaged buildings, temples, and roads that were crucial to the Inca way of life. The Spanish aimed to weaken the Inca civilization by destroying their infrastructure. They ruined important cities and structures, like Cuzco, the capital of the Inca Empire, and many other places that held cultural and historical significance for the Incas. This destruction made it very hard for the Incas to continue their way of life. Their cities and roads were in ruins, and their society faced a lot of chaos and disorder. The destruction caused by the Spanish conquest had a lasting impact on the Inca civilization and contributed to their disappearance. When the Spanish arrived, they not only fought battles but also forced the Incas to adopt their ways. They imposed their language, religion, customs, and laws onto the Inca people. The Spanish tried to erase Inca culture and replace it with their own. They introduced Christianity and made the Incas abandon their beliefs and traditions. The Inca people were forced to follow Spanish customs and rules, which drastically changed their way of life. The Spanish tried to erase Inca history, destroying many records and artifacts that held the stories and knowledge of the Inca civilization. They wanted to establish their own culture and power over the land they conquered. These cultural changes had a profound impact on the Inca society. They lost their traditions, language, and way of life, which had been passed down for generations. The imposition of Spanish culture contributed significantly to the decline and disappearance of the Inca civilization as they knew it. The Inca people left behind a lot of amazing things that we can still see today. They built big cities, like Machu Picchu, high in the mountains. These cities were made of stones that fit together perfectly, without using any cement. Their way of farming was really smart too. They made terraces on hillsides to grow crops and they grew different kinds of potatoes. They also made roads that connected faraway places in their empire. The Incas had a special way of writing too. They used knotted strings called quipus to keep records of things like how many llamas they had or how much food they stored. Even though the Inca Empire disappeared when the Spanish came, their culture still lives on. We can see it in the languages spoken, the traditions followed, and in the ancient ruins that people visit today. The legacy of the Incas is like a hidden treasure, reminding us of their incredible achievements and the way they lived. So now we will have a brief overview of the reasons for the disappearance of the Incas. Spanish arrival. When explorers from Spain arrived in the land of the Incas, they were looking for treasures like gold and silver. The Spanish were very different from the Incas, and they wanted control over the Inca territories. New diseases. The Spanish explorers brought along sicknesses that the Inca people had never been exposed to before, like smallpox and measles. Because the Incas had no immunity to these new diseases, many of them fell terribly ill and couldn't fight back. Spanish conquest. The Spanish were very strong. They had advanced weapons and armor that the Incas didn't have. Even though the Inca people were brave and fought hard to protect their homes, they couldn't defeat the powerful Spanish conquerors. Capture of Inca leader. The Spanish captured the Inca leader, Atahualpa, and this made things even more difficult for the Incas. Despite promises made by the Spanish, Atahualpa was killed, causing a lot of chaos and sadness among the Inca people. Internal conflicts. Before the Spanish arrived, there was a struggle for power among different Inca leaders. This fighting weakened the Inca Empire, making it easier for the Spanish to take control. Destruction of cities. The Spanish didn't just fight the Inca people, they also destroyed many Inca cities and roads. This made it very hard for the Incas to keep their way of life and stay united. Cultural changes. When the Spanish took control, they forced the Inca people to follow their customs, religion, and language. This caused a lot of changes in Inca society and made their own culture slowly disappear. 
These reasons, like getting sick from new diseases, not being able to fight against the powerful Spanish, and big changes in their way of life, all contributed to the downfall of the Inca civilization. Thank you for joining us on this fascinating journey through the ages and exploring the reasons behind the disappearance of the Incas. If you enjoyed delving into the history of the Incas and understanding how these incredible people shaped the world around them, don't forget to leave a like, share the video with your friends, and subscribe to stay updated on more exciting historical adventures. Your support means a lot to us, and until next time, stay curious and explore the world around you. Goodbye.